okay, yes. Go on, Doug, and BJ Constructions. We're at the Fimba Bar job. I'll just have a quick look. Thanks. Thanks, Tommy. Um, right, uh, last time you saw this place, we had the back of the house. We'll go at the back and have a quick look from there. Um, you can see that we've pulled the uh, windows and doors out. We've got it prop, propped up right through the back there, ready for the big beam. You'll see the beam on side here, the size of the beam that we've got to go in. It's a 310 UV beam, and it's 6.5 metres long. Um, you have a good look at that. It's a nice big chunk of steel. So we've really got to get that from these trolleys using those lifters over here and lift it up in the position. We've got one major problem here uh, with the brick footing, the concrete footing, sorry. Uh, we've got a, got a post down on here and this brick has got to be removed with put the saw cut through it. So we a post in here on this. When we lift the beam up from the inside, we can have a look there for the opening from the inside of the house now. Where it's all been opened up. So we get a steel column over in that side over there, and another steel column over this side to hold the beam up. Uh, engineer's on his way at the moment, and we're going to discuss how we're going to place this column on this side here. Uh, owner's done some work himself, jackhammered up the place and penetrated through the slab. Uh, that's going to have to be all sort of determined. We found termites in this house as well. We've gone right up the walls on the other side of here. And uh, we're also into the uh, floor structures. We don't know how bad they are yet. So this is a bit of a look on where we are. And we'll come back later. Another look after the beam. So try to get that beam up today and the door in place. So we'll come back and just give a bit of a look at how we go later on. Okay, so 